history of Six Sigma at Motorola can be summarized as follows. The term Six Sigma was coined by Bill Smith, an engineer with Motorola. Motorola is the company that invented Six Sigma. Late 1970s, Motorola started experimenting with problem solving through statistical analysis. 1987, Motorola officially launched its Six Sigma program. Motorola saved $17 billion from 1986 to 2004, reflecting hundreds of individual successes in the business areas like sales and marketing, customer service, transactional processes, product design. Dr. Mikhail J. Harry played a crucial role in formulating the DMAIC approach. The history of Six Sigma at GE can be summarized as follows. Jack Welch launched Six Sigma at GE in January 1996. GE saved $750 million by the end of 1998. GE cut invoice defects and disputes by 98%, speeding payment and creating better productivity. They also streamlined the contract review process, leading to a faster completion of deals and annual savings of a million dollars. 1998-99, the Sigma Greenbelt exam became the criteria for management promotions. 2002-03, the Six Sigma Greenbelt Certification became the criteria for management promotions. The milestones in the history of continuous improvement and their impact on other improvement models. Walter A. Schuhart worked at the Hawthorne plant of Western Electric where he developed and used control charts. He is sometimes referred to as the father of statistical process control because he brought together the disciplines of statistics, engineering, and economics. W. Edwards Deeming developed a list of 14 points in which he emphasized the need for change in management structure and attitude. He developed a plan, do, check, act model, which is also known as Deeming's Wheel. Joseph M. Duran pursued a varied career in management beginning in 1924 as an engineer. He developed the Duran Trilogy, consisting of three managerial processes, quality planning, quality control, and quality improvement. Deming and Duran worked in both the U.S. and Japan to help businesses understand the importance of continuous process improvement. Philip B. Crosby, who originated the Zero Defects concept, was an ASQ honorary member and past president. He has written 14 steps to quality improvement. Armand V. Fagenbaum originated the concept of total quality control. He lists three steps to quality. Quality leadership, modern quality technology, organizational commitment. Kaoru Ishikawa developed the cause and effect diagram, which is also known as the Ishikawa and Fishbone Diagram. He worked with Deming through the Union of Japanese Scientists and Engineers, JUSE. Janichi Taguchi taught that any departure from the nominal or target value for a characteristic represents a loss to society. He also popularized the use of fractional factorial experiments and stressed the concept of robustness. Quality circles 1979 to 1981 are quality improvement or self-improvement study groups composed of a small number of employees, 10 or fewer. Statistical process control mid-1980s the application of statistical techniques to control a process, also called the statistical quality control. ISO 9000, 1987 to present, a set of international standards of quality system elements 
to be implemented to maintain an efficient quality system. Re-engineering 1996 through 1997, a breakthrough approach involving the restructuring of an entire organization and its processes. Benchmarking 1988 through 1996, an improvement process in which a company measures its performance against that of best-in-class companies, determines how those companies achieve their performance levels, and uses the information to improve its own performance. Balanced Scorecard, 1990s through present, a management concept that helps managers at all levels monitor results in their key areas. Baldridge Award Criteria, 1987 through present, an award established by the U.S. Congress in 1987 to raise awareness of quality management and recognize U.S. companies that have successfully implemented quality management systems. Six Sigma, 1995 through present, as described in previous slides. Lean Manufacturing, 2000 to present, focuses on reduction of wastage and improvement of value-added services. Lean Six Sigma, 2002 through present, this approach combines the individual concepts of Lean and Six Sigma and recognizes that both are necessary to effectively drive sustained improvement. Six Sigma started with manufacturing industries like automotive, consumer products, shipbuilding, etc. Its methodology was adopted by process industries such as pharmaceuticals, food production, pulp and paper, etc. Currently, we are in the age of the service industry and Six Sigma has been beneficially adopted by the service industry along with lean tools.